What's up guys, welcome to another video and today we're going to be doing a bit of uh, the special league for RTA So you can see here the special league, it's about uh, just over a couple of days left um, So I think it's a good time now to start climbing up I mean I've done a little bit but I'm actually starting to, to decay So um, by any, if I, as long as I do a match now I won't decay anymore um, But yeah, I'm going to try to climb up a, a bit this video I, I I probably still do want to end like as high as I can. Um, uh, mostly just to get the points, you know, for the rankings. Uh, you get a lot of points depending on what uh, rank you finish at. Obviously, the higher the better. Okay, this guy's starting off with Lucian. He stole my Lucian, so I think we'll go with. Uh, we'll switch to. Bulldozer. Right. Uh, okay, that's fine. Um, then we'll pick. I'm, I'm looking for something to counter the Gany and the. Not the Gany, um, the Laika and the um, Peace Armor. I think we'll go with. Perna Wind Panda, alright? Like, both of those are pretty good against those sort of units. Most likely at the moment I'm going to ban Lucian. If I get first turn I can at least try to boost my Bulldozer and kill the Lucian. Um, and either way I have ways to... Um... Oh actually, maybe I can just ban the Lucian now. I don't think the Lyca will keep up with the Megan Bernard. Peace armor might move though. Um, right, let's just ban the Bernard, we'll see how it goes. Alright, um, pick this. I think that's my only leader skill. That's probably a good thing that he didn't ban. If he, did, if he, if he banned my Immensity, I wouldn't have a leader skill. But I have a way to. I can boost attack for my Pona, and I can also boost defense for, for the. Bulldozer, so there's a lot of ways for me to deal with the comp. Alright, so we'll take out the um, Revolution first. Right, he's gonna move, Peace Armor will move. I'm protected from the uh, the reset at least. Oh, wait. Uh, let's boost. I actually don't want to move, I don't want Perna to move yet. So, we'll, yeah, we'll boost the Bulldozer. I can now try to stun the, the Lyca. No, I, I got at least I got triple hits, so at least that helps a bit. Oh wait, it's not on vampire, so I can probably snipe it. Once that's taken out, I should be okay. Um, I think we we'll stunned the peace armor. Nope, didn't get it. I think I resisted that, so that's a good thing. So, Perna will at least have another life. We'll take out the, the Lyca now. Boost. Oh. Okay, good. I still have my extra life, so we'll go for the Peace Army. He's the only DPS left. Actually, I'll just leave him alone. He's, uh, he's stunned up, so we'll go for the, the Megan now. Um, actually, don't really need to heal even. Oh, I try to stun this guy. Nope. Reduce the tap bar. He doesn't have his um his uh, his reset yet. Oh, never mind. I have to hit him now. So he'll kill the Perna. It will um come back to life. Uh, okay, I cut in before he could move. That's good. Okay, um, so actually I want to talk something a bit about the rewards. One, one thing, well, this is the reason why I didn't actually do um, much of this special league. If you look at the league shop, it costs 3,000 points to get the, the Ifrit, okay? Uh, the, the skin. Um, now, it's actually only really possible to get this if you win... If you need, well, first off, you need about a 75% win rate, all right? 
After that, you need to end, uh, I believe it's... I believe you need to end about... Or you have to end G3, right, to get enough points as well. So, it's only really accessible to a very small amount of people. And I didn't like that uh, because, you know, I feel that if you at least end maybe G1, you should better have enough points to get one Ifrit. I think that would have been fair. Because uh, anyone who's high up already doesn't really care about the Ifrit, right? Because they probably already have like multiple Ifrits from get, like, ending G2 or G3. Um, so it's less important to them, but it's more important to people who are maybe Conqueror level or below, right? But if as long as these points carry over to the next special league, maybe it's okay. Like if you can save them up, I don't think Comptor was actually um, like confirmed whether it's going to carry over. I assume they will carry over. Otherwise, I don't know, it'd be a waste of getting the points anyway. Uh, like from the rankings, like you you wouldn't you only have enough to buy the flaming conqueror aura thing. Um, what's it? I'm gonna pick. Uh, Sierra first to lock that in. So yeah, I, I don't, I'm not sure how worthwhile this league is. If it does carry over to the next special league, that'll be fine. But otherwise, not not too thrilled about it. All right, I'm gonna pick bulldozer to to counteract the uh, the two fire two fire units. I don't care about any of these units right now, based on my current draft. So depending on what he picks last, then I can lock him my last pick. I can I, have, I can you know pick anything since I have six stars. All right, so he's going all fire, all out fire. Um, let's see, what do I want to bring? I'm gonna try out uh, this guy, even though it's like less stars. Um, let's see, the only thing I really care about here. Is maybe the Chloe. I think he might ban Sierra though. If he bans Sierra, actually, it's not too bad. It'll be Anavol versus the world, basically. Yeah, we'll take out the Chloe because I, I don't actually have a way to deal with the immunity. Oh, he take out Boost Bulldozer. That's, that's okay, actually. So I've lowered the defensive skills as well now. So I've got like cleanse, heals, and the defense buff. So it'd be hard for him to hit, like to beat the to uh, attack me. We're gonna focus down the probably the Kamoon. because the shield will be the shield will be annoying, I think. All right, so I'm gonna boost Gara first, and. Actually, maybe I take out someone else. I can probably take out the Raki straight out with um the well the, with uh, Sierra Bomb. Although in hindsight, maybe I should have gone for the Anvil, but that's okay. I'll get rid of her straight away. Just make it uneven from the get go. And I don't think Kumun, even on the crit damage build, will do enough to kill Sierra, so I should be fine. Oh, it's on, it's on violent. Interesting. Okay, we're slow. And we'll cleanse this off. This is why I like um, Kona a lot. It's because it's a two star, so it, it allows you to pick more, like, it gives you more, more room for stars, right? Um, and it's Oh wait, hang on. Uh, I bombed the anvil, but like it's gonna cleanse. Never mind, doesn't matter. I can get rid of the at the debuff at least. Actually, not that it matters. Oh, is that a revenge? That's a revenge uh, anvil. That's interesting. Okay. I'll just try to stun this guy. Okay, good. Stun. Oh, that's a nice stun. Um, should I bomb the animal? I'm not going to detonate yet. There's no point detonating.
This is it won't kill. All right, so I'm gonna boost Sierra just because I want to cycle her turn so that she can bomb again. I I hit I hit the Colleen because I think um, or if the Kamun moved, it would um it would uh would have put the shield on the Colleen. I don't I don't mind if it does that. But he quit anyway. I was gonna probably bomb the uh, animal, just get rid of it straight out, and I could probably recover with uh, Kona's heal uh, afterwards. Okay. So yeah, um, obviously Kona always has a lot of utility. Attack bar boost in general is very strong in this format. Um, plus, like the heal and stuff, and the cleanse is really nice. As you could see, getting rid of getting rid of things like defense break is pretty big. Uh, he picked the Sierra, so I think we'll go with. Uh, I'll start with Bulldozer Immensity. I think it's a good counter straight out against Sierra alone. Depends what else he picks, of, of course, but he picks like supporting units around that. Okay, Laika, I think Garo will come in here. It's pretty nice. Pick Garo, and we'll. Oh, he took a Raccoonie actually, but that's okay. Uh, we'll pick. Pick Parana for now. Just like force a lot of damage in. P Sama. Okay, he's got a lot of water now. Um, can he pick a nap for? Let's go with what's just soon. Yeah, we'll go with just soon. So I have attack buff as well for the the two uh, fire attackers, and I have heals to sustain through as well. Uh, I think we shall ban. Hmm. Actually, don't know. I think we'll ban uh... Kona. Yeah, we'll ban Kona. And speed, I guess. This is just because I think I should be able to snipe the uh, the Sierra. I hope, at least. Okay. Um. Just poke this guy first. Okay, that's fine. I get attacked by if I don't die yet. Oh, okay, he's gonna die. I didn't get it. I didn't get a turn. That's okay. Uh, we'll take out the Sierra, I guess. Try to at least. Okay, that evens it out a bit. I'm not sure if I'm gonna win this though. The Leica will. I was banking on the the Gara being there still to take out the Leica, but I didn't get enough attack bar from the narrow escape to cut in, unfortunately. Right, we're gonna try to focus this guy though. Uh, poke this guy. Okay, gotta survive. Oh, what you know? He's gonna kill. Oh, he, uh, he might glance, I guess. And he pulled us to survive. Alright, good. Now I can try to stun this guy, hopefully. Alright, that was a good stun. Oh, that was a good violent proc. Can I kill? Oh, not quite. Uh, I think I'm gonna kill him off with this. No! Damn it! I didn't get him. Uh, that sucks. Oh, Bulldoze is still alive, but he's gonna die now. But we can take out this guy. 2v2, that evens it out. Uh, so we're going to focus on the uh, Raccoonie, I guess. It'll be the easiest to kill. 
I think it's it looked like a pretty squishy one, and I think did I, I think I re resisted the uh, reset too. Yeah, I resisted it, so that's good. I just need. Well, actually, Flame Nova should Flame Nova should be able to kill it if uh, I get a turn. Hopefully, he doesn't reset me. Okay, good. Just didn't have it up yet. Oh, that was a good Vine proc. Alright, I was pretty lucky. I was really lucky there. <clears throat> There's one thing I don't like about this format is... I feel that it's a bit limited. Um, like a lot of the drafts that I, I do are all based around basically the same team. It's like Bulldozer Copper, or it's like Bulldozer Immensity, and then like... Otherwise, it's Lucian. I think everyone has these as well, so it's kind of like... I feel like it's a very limited format. Um, whereas, the, the standard format, you can pick like pretty much anything. And there's a lot more team vari team comp varieties that you can build. Uh, whereas this one, like most people kind of have the same sort of thing. Because you, you have to draft low star units. And a lot of people will pick, obviously, the best ones, which will be like Konamiya, Rakuni... Immensity, Copper Bulldozer, that, that sort of thing. Olivia as well. If I had Olivia, this team would be a lot better. Because uh, as, as you can see, he could just ban out my uh, Immensity, and I don't, I don't have the um, the buff any, uh, the like defense buff anymore. Okay, um, I think I'm gonna go with the same thing because he's still picking. Like this is like pretty much the same sort of comp down first thing. Bulldozer is obviously, str obviously strong against both of those units. Um, oh, okay. He took away the Orion. Oh, never mind. Um, most likely here, I'm, I'm going to look to ban the Orion. Oh, no, I took the Garrow. Wait, is this the same guy? That no, can't be, I don't think. But he, he's picking very similar units. Um... First I'll bring Tessa. My Tessa's not on Violent, which is a bit of a shame, but I think it's still good in this scenario. And we'll bring Wusa. I only have one real threat here, which he'll most likely ban, which is the Bulldozer. I guess he could ban the, uh, the Tessarian, but I've, I think that opens him up to just losing straight out at the start. Because most likely, I think I'm just going to ban Garrow here. Yeah, let's ban Garrow. Alright, um... I'll bring crit rate. My Tessarian has, like, no crit rate, because uh, I built him for Guild Wars. I, I kind of regret it now. I should have built him a bit more hybrid. And he's, he's not on violent because of Guild Wars, which is another downside. I was thinking of building a second Tessarian just for RTA, but I don't have Devilmon for that. Alright, we can take out... Oh wait, who shall we take out? I think we take out the Sierra first. Yeah, take out the Sierra first. Um, I don't really need a resurge right now. Oh, actually no. Let's resurge this guy and then uh, we'll do the Oblivion on this guy. Hopefully Oblivion too. Uh, defense break, sorry. Defense break and oblivion. So I'm gonna try to take him out soon after. Oh, okay. He's researched, so he's gonna get rid of that. But at least I forced him to do that, and he didn't automatically just cleanse it. Um, it was slow. Hopefully. Oh, slow on everyone. That's pretty good. Uh, go for the stun on the the Lyca. Nope. Okay, keep working on this Raccoonie. Especially because I don't want him to cleanse, of course. Oh my god, he violent out of it again. I mean, he didn't, I mean, not again, but like he violent out of it. Wow, he's getting so many turns though. It's actually ridiculous. Um. I think I'll do that. OK, 
Okay, that didn't kill, that's good. Get rid of this guy, hopefully. Uh, I think he's pretty much dead. Just poke him just in case. Uh, okay, for the stun. Nope. Okay, uh, boost the bulldozer and get the double hit on this guy. Okay, got the stun. Oblivion. Still does pretty good damage, even though he's not... He's actually on like a tank build. He's like speed, HP, HP, but he's still got pretty good, um, pretty good damage out of him. As long as he crits, of course. Okay, I think we'll start with Kona again. It's a very fire heavy meta, which is not too good for me. Oh, okay. Speedy comp here. Uh, he's gonna pick Leo, wasn't he? Um, Two Garrow first and a big Perna. Okay, so I want to take this and I can pick one more net five. Let's pick Wind Panda because it's self sustaining. At the moment, I'll probably ban the Wusa though. Because if he bans Iris, I'll be screwed. So I, I kind of have to ban the Wusa. Now for, I can't really think of one that I would be particularly scared of with this particular comp. Because he doesn't have any attack or defense buffing units, so he can't really wombo me. I guess he could boost like a Lucian, but like, he won't do much damage. Right, it's like all supports, right? So I'm just going to ban... Um, I mean, he's pretty much guaranteed first turn, so there's no point fighting him for that. I'm going to take out the Wusa and we'll focus down the um, Tessarian. Either that or I can ban Najin. No, I think I'll do this. Oh, he actually left my Iris alone. That's interesting. Okay. But I think we should be good. I have Cleanse for the Oblivion too. I mean, I can't stop that, so he'll go, Orion will go, etc. Okay, resist everything, that seems good. I think he'll go for the uh, Iris with the Oblivion. Yep. Okay, um, I actually don't really need to cleanse the, that Oblivion yet, so because there's nothing to remove anyway. So we're just going to focus down the uh, Tessarian. Actually, I wanna, I'm going to silence the Orion, just so he can't use uh, fly, yeah, fly Fly to defense break. The stun was good too, but wasn't intentional. Uh, we'll get the heals up because he doesn't have a lot of damage, right? So if I have heal over time plus Perna as passive, it's gonna be very hard for him to hit, like to uh, to hit me. Okay. Well, like to touch you to like to do enough damage anyway. Okay, I keep focusing him. Research and this should be able to kill. Oh I, no, I didn't crit. My opponent's only 85 crit, um, mostly for Guild Wars, so that's a that's a, a shame. But um, Rakuni will cleanse, but uh, only after the Tessar has moved, so I have time to uh, to hit him. Um, let's see. I should I should cleanse that though. So he doesn't hit the Piranha too high. I, was, I, I want to keep the second life, obviously. Don't want to waste it. Uh, he's already triple crushed, so I'm going to silence uh, the Orion again. 
Uh, I don't really need a heal yet, so I'm just going to try to defense break him. Defense break him, never mind. Missing that crit was crucial. It made a big difference. Oh, he landed Oblivion, that's, that's bad. I'm hoping that Makona can cut in here. Okay, so I can research and get rid of that Oblivion. This might even be able to kill it. Yeah, good. So now it's pretty much in the bag. He, he won't be able to just like bait this. I have like plenty of sustain, right? I've got Iris, Panda, and um, Pona heals. Okay, I'll start off the game with Kona because this allows this is like a flexible pick. It allows me to go in a lot of different directions. Plus, even in like a um, even in a um, like a bruiser type team, he's still good in there because no one's gonna focus him. Actually, what did I pick? I picked the wrong unit. Actually, um, I was supposed to pick Bulldozer. Uh. Pick the fire monkey here, I think, and pick Garo. He probably pick an attack power buffer. Oh no, he's already got one. No, he's got the uh, wind barbaric king. Interesting team comp. Ah. Uh... I'm actually mostly scared of the Fey. Even though there's a um, Chloe there. Let's take out the Fey. Because she's the neutral damage dealer. Right. Um, let's see. Bring. Yeah, I'm gonna go with Fire Speed Lead actually. Because I want the turns so that um, the Gara can move more often. Uh, and therefore, like, the higher his attack by is, the more likely he'll cut in if he takes or if his passive activates. Which will make him very hard to kill. Like, I could potentially just solo him. Oh, the Chloe's faster. That's a bit of a waste of a buff, I feel. Cause he's gonna buff with that, and then he's gonna move. I mean, the Kona will probably die, and probably the uh, Immensity too. But I have the other two. Oh, never mind. He crit everything. That is actually ridiculous. Okay. Oh, we'll see how we go. I'm actually on Vampire, so I should better cut in and potentially. Oh, never mind. He violent proct that. That screwed me over. Oh my god, he even crit my, my Monkey King. That That is... that's really annoying. As long as the Monkey King survived as well, I could have healed up with both. And then... Like, because they have, they have self-sustain. They're both on Vampire as well, so that, that that's why I would have been to get it. Uh, let's see... Recruiting first pickers, I think we'll go with Bulldozer first. Okay, um... Let's go with Tessa and... Let's go with Sierra. Oh my god, he took my Kona. Um, what do I have left? I have... Uh, oh, I can pick Megan actually. That works too, that's another attack... Oh, so there's another defense buffer. 
Yeah, let's do that. Now, who shall we ban here? I think we ban... I think I have to ban the Velodrill. He's most likely going to ban... Bulldozer, I'm, I'm thinking. Because that because these are the only thing that can kill the Velodrill. And if, I, if he has immunity, I can't oblivion him and I can't uh, bomb him. So I'm going to ban that. And pick speed lead. <clears throat> Okie dokie. Um, buff Megan. And then she can buff after that. Uh, I think we'll take out the... The Parano first, if we can Oblivion. Actually, I don't really need a defense break. Oh my god, you cut in. My Sierra's not fast enough. That's a shame. Um, I think we could take out the Kona then. Since otherwise it's going to cleanse. This probably won't kill though. Oh, nope, nope. That is a shame. Uh, let's get rid of that speed buff, I guess. She's, like, Megan's not going to do much else. This is going to be tough. Oh damn, that's stun though. That was pretty lame. Oblivion. No crit. Oh my god. Uh, wait. Let's see. Boost this guy. Maybe I can Oblivion try to take out something. Actually, no. They're all pretty high health. Let's just do this, I guess. Nah, I can't, I can't win from there. I'm still trying to work out this format a bit more. I've only, I actually have very limited experience with this format. You can probably tell by the amount of points I have. I mean like the... Uh, the currency. Darien! Okay, that's interesting. There's a lot of low stars. Like, he can pretty much... Like, he can pick... Like a five star. Um... Five star for each of his last picks, actually. Pick this and do Sierra first. Oh, fancy! Uh, this and this. I can also kind of do the same, because i got 2 star and 3 star. So I guess we'll see what he picks for last. Because I want to ban... Oh, I wanted to ban the Yong Hong, but I might need to ban the Velodrill. Yeah, I have to ban the Velodrill. It's unfortunate, I don't have a... I don't have... Well, there's not that many good strippers that are low... Um, low star rating. I have Iris. That's about it, I think. I guess there's Bella, but I obviously want like AoE. Don't really want to pick Aquila. Most of them actually not fives. Uh, let's see, we'll boost. Don't really need to boost yet, actually. I think we'll go for Colleen. She's the attack buffer. To this. Actually, maybe we can snipe the Darien. 
If a defense break, never mind. Of course not. Uh, right, we'll go for the stun on the Lyca then. Nope, I can't get anything. Fiery Dance, so I have to stun this Lyca. I actually have to detonate straight off. Because he's going to hurt. Otherwise... Wow, he resists that too. And I got revenged on. This is... This is the worst. Esports everywhere. Oh, wait a minute. I can heal up a bit. This Darien though. This is actually ridiculous. I think my best bet actually is to try to snipe this guy. And I can't even defense break him, so never mind that. I'm gonna try to win one game. Oh my god, I can't even stun him. I've, I've done so many... Like, I've tried to stun him so many times. Uh, try to heal this Sierra up. Give me another proc. Nope. Alright, well that's good enough anyway. Uh, try to heal up a bit. Gotta keep that Sierra alive. Uh, let's see, we'll bomb. Kind of the bomb the like, I guess. Uh, can I get a stun for once in my life? Oh my goodness. Another one? Wow, I've tried so many times. Cannot do it. He's got justice, I think. Oh, there goes Perna. Wow, he even resists that bomb too. This is stupid. Um, gotta heal Sierra up again. The only thing I know is that that Yong is not in revenge, right? So I, that's why I'm hitting her over the other two because I don't want to get revenge defense broken by the the, the Darian. It, see, it felt like he's on triple revenge or something. He was revenging so much. Can I, for once, land something. Oh my god! I think this is pretty. This is pretty much a max res. Like I'm pretty sure. Oh dear. I can't. I can't do anything. I, sh I should have banned the Lyca. I don't know. Actually, I think it was bad either way. I, it was hard. It was hard for me to to win from there. But uh, I like what, no matter what I what I picked because Velajul plus Yong Hong is pretty much impossible to kill. Okay, that's what I like to see. A unit that's not too useful. Um, let's see. I want to test out Garrett a bit more. Maybe we'll do something like this to start with. Okay, I think we'll do this. Have room for another nap 4. Uh, Maybe Orion. Oh, actually, wait. Orion might not be a good idea here. Kabila. I actually don't think this Kabila will... I don't think the units will be able to cut in afterwards. I think I might actually just pick this and then ban a Wusa. Because I think he's going to ban... The uh, iris. <clears throat> okay, what is he gonna ban? Oh, he's gonna ban the better. Okay, fair enough. Uh, okay, we'll go for. Speed lead. Yeah, do universal speed lead. 
Because I think I should be able to cut in between the Kabila. Because I don't think it'll be fast. Like, I think the other units won't be fast enough to keep up. Assuming it's a very fast Kabila. And plus I have speed lead to, to, to help me help my other units to cut in. Okay, as expected. Um I'm actually gonna go for the field Mars. Try to strip Yep. Good. Also got the silence off, which is important. Uh This, I feel this. Oh, never mind. I didn't crit. I think he might be able to kill. Oh, he didn't go for the iris. Wow, he's focusing the Sierra. Uh, let's see. Go for the stun, maybe? Nope, no stuns. I'm going for the bomb then. I should be able to kill something with this. I think we'll kill off. Actually, no. We should, we should stun the uh, the field Mars. He's, he's the he's the highest damage dealing unit there. And pop the Endure. Oh, I didn't kill him. Oh, he didn't violent proc. Unfortunately, that was like the one time I would have liked him to violent proc. He might be able to kill the Iris. Depends how much damage this uh, ambush does. Does not kill. That's that. That's lucky. So she's still alive there. Bomb this guy. Uh, get poking that. Oh, almost dead. I think it's, it should die. Oh, so hopefully, hopefully Sierra can survive. Hopefully, this isn't violent proc. It's very close. Oh my God, violent proc! Of course, he violent procs. What else would he do? Uh, I think a science. I think he's got heal, so let's get rid of that. Make Iris move again. Okay, that was a good stun. And we'll try to stun the Retesh. Nope. He's alright, he's silent, it's not too bad. Finish this guy off. Okay, it's pretty much in the bag. There's like no there's no way that you can beat Garo. Okay. Maybe we'll do one more. Oh, we'll try to get one more win. Since I don't like any on the last. Hopefully, we can get in the next one. Level 38. Um, I think we'll go back to the bulldozer strap for now. Alright, picked a lot of water. Uh, we'll go with... Alright, Sierra Kona should be a lot more stable. Like, this allows me to pick um, like a Lucian or like another Nat 5 maybe, depending on what he picks. He's going to pick Perna. If I ban Perna, I could probably pick Lucian. So where's, where's my slow Lucian? Okay, pick Lucian, and we'll ban Perna. Okay, good. That works out best for me, because... I should better take out at least... I should at least better take out the Bastet, and I should outspeed him, because I've got speed lead, he doesn't. And then... Bulldozer can take out... Probably the Colleen, I guess. See who like who survives this. Oh, a lot of people survive. That's surprising. That's very unfortunate. 
Oh my god, it stuns it. My stuns my main units as well. Oh my goodness. This is not my day. Uh think of the heal up. Otherwise that that Molon can easily snipe the Lucian. Oh never mind, he's gonna snipe it anyway. Or not. That's an easy snipe if he wanted to. Never mind, he goes for the Sierra. Maybe I can take this guy out. Oh my god, nope. I feel like yeah, I glanced, that's why. Um I have to take this guy out. Oh my god, never mind. Wow, I couldn't even kill that guy. This is ridiculous. Um, research. I don't normally use this skill, but I have to because, like. Oh my god, that Panathin died. I thought it would die. I think I did a glance. Is that why? I, I've made so many. I think I've made so many mistakes here. This is my bad. Wait, we can take this guy out at least. Alright, finally killed him. Um, get a attack bar maybe. I think I have to go for the stuns. I need, I need to protect everyone. Never mind. I didn't get any. Oh my god, he crit Sierra, are you kidding me? Uh, do this. And we'll take out... Oh, the Colleen should be the easiest to kill. Never mind, it was not. JK. Just need Lucian to survive. I can amp again. Hopefully this amp can kill. Oh my god, he cut in. Oh shit. I got attack debuff. Oh, he goes nothing. Uh, I don't know about this one. 2v... 2v1. Actually, Bulldash should be able to take it out, I guess. He's got a lot, he has a lot of heals though. Man. I feel I play this so badly. This is I'm so sorry guys. I play this terribly. This could have gone so much better if I like didn't get greedy. I should have just taken out the Molong when I had a chance. I don't know why I used the second skill. This should kill, right? Okay, cool. Oh my god. Alright, I think I'm gonna end the day before I like tilt myself out. Alright, um, most likely I'll still continue like, later, in, like in the wait, maybe more towards the end. Uh, I'm not sure how far I want to bother climbing, but we'll see. Um, maybe try to get like C3, G1 sort of area, hopefully. Alright, so thanks guys for watching, I hope you enjoyed that. Learn from my mistakes, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye bye!